I'm getting a lot of emails these days about pitching your story to bloggers. How is it different than pitching to mainstream media? What are their deadlines like? Those kind of things. As I thought about it, the truth is there is no difference between pitching the media and pitching bloggers. Uh, they have egos, they have deadlines, they don't want to be pitched commercials. It, treat them the same as you would print radio and television. Okay, this is a website called planetgreen.com, also known as treehugger.com. It's an environmentally friendly website, and they actually appeal to the masses. They, they go into green sex tips. Doesn't that sound like something that you would see on your, your local tabloid station? But I want you to check this out. Bed Bath & Beyond gets a nice plug in here for bamboo fiber sheets. So think about that. You could actually work your way into a very popular website, treehugger.com, if you have something going on in your business that is environmentally friendly and you can help build a storyline around it. Now don't laugh this off and say, who really reads these blogs? Everyone reads the blogs, including the mainstream media. Websites like uh, the Drudge Report, the Huffington Post, those are websites that are monitored all the time by the media. You could start out by pitching a blogger, and the next thing you know, you're in the New York Times. I hope this was valuable to you, and if there's somebody else in your life who could use this information, please pass it along, and then I'll see you next week. It was passionate, it was direct, it was informational information was useful and timely. I can hardly wait to get it out to my group of gals. Take note of what reporters do for a living. Great information. Real practical. I don't